Good afternoon. This presentation is on biomimetic composites by Joel Cannon, Juan Nieto, and Stephanie Richens in Chemical Engineering 361G M01 in the Department of Chemical and Material Engineering at NMSU with Professor Neda Sanatkaran. Biomimetic materials have been engineered and designed with inspiration from nature. The word biomimetic comes from the Greek word bios, meaning life, and mimetikos, meaning to imitate. Some structures in, that are biomimetic materials include hexagonal beehive-inspired honeycombs. The advantages of these structures is that they're lightweight, they require minimal materials, they support heavy loads, and they preserve rigidity. Some uses include automotive industries, railway industries, and security industries. The figure on the right shows a honeycomb sandwich structure used in aircraft. Another structure are hoop, hook and loop fasteners, or Velcro. Hook and loop fasteners consist of many small plastic hooks on one side and small loops on the other. The inspiration from these fasteners came from George de Mestral in 1940 when he saw cockleburs stuck to his pants when he was walking. Some uses include the clothing industries, the aerospace industries, and consumer products. The third structure we'll be discussing is bone tissue engineering. A one way to do this is mimicking the structure of bone tissue to create composites for medical uses. The materials used are often gelatin, collagen, and bioactive ceramics. Some uses include mending fractures and breaks, degenerative bone diseases, and with patients undergoing radiation therapy. The manufacturing for biomimetic, uh, biomimetic materials is often <clears throat> consists of 3D printing. The material used in 3D printing is often polymer, and polymer can be used in airplane wings and in Velcro, as stated before in the previous slides. The applications to biomimetic composites is actually limitless. As seen to the right, um, biomimetics here is applied by the concept of a box fish's body. Uh, by emulating a box fish's body, Chrysler developed a concept car that was actually more stable, aerodynamic, and had more average fuel efficiency than the average car, reaching uh, the, a maximum speed of 190 kilometers per hour. Uh, the, according to the U.S. National Library of Medicine, National Institutes of Health, the nature of new biomimetic materials lies in discovering hierarchical structures and their corresponding functions to remodel them into something we can utilize. Basically, this means is the concept of biomimetic materials is often used to innovate new, um, new designs or actually imp improve previous designs by using uh, biomimetic materials, uh, imitating nature. Uh, the main challenges for biomimetic composites is actually finding a problem that can be applied to, to the modern world, finding qualified scientists in different fields that work together, the lack of technology that it takes to manufacture these biomimetic composites, and the actual cost of manufacturing these um, biomimetic, biomimetic composites. In conclusion, biomimetic materials have been created with nature as an inspiration. They can be seen in common structures like Velcro, ceramic and bone scaffolds, airplane wings, and concept ve vehicles. Biomimetic materials and composites are an important part of modern si science and engineering. 